I had good friends that say, you know, my tax bill is now went from like 4,500 to 7,000, from 7,000 to 10,000. Property taxes are once again the hot topic at households all over Kettleland as homeowners react to another round of higher bills this January. Good evening, I'm Bridget Bennett. For the third year in a row, property tax bills have seen some major increases in many counties. Tonight we're hearing from homeowners and leaders in Lincoln County where property tax complaints are common. In 2020, it was $2,800 a year in taxes and now it's $4,100 a year in taxes. Over the past three years, Colin McKenzie's monthly mortgage payment on his Harrisburg home has seen constant increases. Half of my bill goes to insurance and taxes and half my go, a bill goes to my mortgage payment. He says many of his friends and neighbors are frequently talking about the increases, with some now paying nearly $1,000 a month in property taxes for their home. A lot of them are saying, you know, it's increased 30, 40, 50 percent um, from last year to this year. We've had people that have called me with 30, 35 percent, and that's pretty drastic. And I understand when they say, how do you expect us to pay this? Uh, I, <laughs> I have no answers for them. Lincoln County Commissioner Jim Schmidt says he understands taxes are high, but also knows the financial demands of serving a growing community. Sioux Falls is a booming community. Look at the number of people we add every year here. That has property values soaring. 23, it was approximately a 16% um, assessment increase on average countywide. That's after a 14.5% increase in 2021 and an 8% increase in property assessments in 2020. But property values alone aren't the only reason for the increase in tax bills. The one that fluctuate the most is the schools add to bonds. The mill levy for the growing Harrisburg School District is one of the highest in the state as new schools are frequently added to accommodate all of the growth in the district. Bonds that are usually the result of a public vote with a very small voter turnout. That 3-4% of the population in that district are determining the amount of money they're going to spend and ultimately affect their tax rates. Schmidt says one of the biggest things homeowners can control when it comes to property taxes is actually getting out to vote on bond issues. People actually move to Lincoln County so they can be in the Harrisburg School District. It comes with a price tag. I mean, there's, there's no doubt about it. Everything comes with a price tag. Now McKenzie says he also feels the assessed value for his home is fair and even below the market value he'd be able to get in today's market. But if you feel like there is something off about the assessed value of your home, you have a short window con to contest the next property tax assessments that will be going out by March 1st. Any appeals to 2024 assessments need to be made by March 14th to your city or township.